Good morning. Happy Monday, everyone. I hope everyone is having a blessed and wonderful morning. Um, I just woke up. <laughs> Today is going to be a interesting day, guys. So I'm going to bring you guys along on my fasting day so you guys can see what <clears throat> a day looks like for me when I am fasting. So yesterday, you may have um, already seen my um, date night vlog. I think that's going to be uploaded before this one. Um, but it was basically a cheat day for me. So I did have a few pieces of bread. Um, and so today, the next day, um, I've decided to fast the whole day. I just want to clean my body from, you know, basically that bread I ate yesterday, you know? So today is a cleansing, fasting day. So on days like this, I usually have to keep myself pretty busy and occupied. Like, because if I sit around and do nothing, I'm going to think about food. So, um, I'm probably going to do a little house cleaning, probably run a few errands. Um, and throughout the day, I have to drink tons and tons of water. So you'll constantly see me drink water. Um... Probably I'll throw in some exercising. I'm just going to be doing a bunch of everything today. Um, and, and I just wanted to bring you guys along to, you know, see a day in the life of me fasting. Um, so, I'm going to get out of bed and we're going to get this day started, guys. See you later. Or, you know, see you in a sec. <laughs> So this is my outfit for today. Let's see if you can see it. So these are my um, gray pink leggings. They're kind of like workout pants. You'll probably see a lot of videos of me in these because they are so comfy. Um, they're for everyday wear to work out in. Um, when I know I'm gonna be super active, well, that's probably every day. Um, but when I know I'm gonna be cleaning, running errands, um, I have two pairs of these. I have a gray pair and I have a pink pair and I love to throw these on. They're super comfortable. Um, actually, hopefully when they open back up, I'm, I'm able to go buy some more. But yeah, I'm, gonna, I'm wearing my pink um, leggings and then just, you know, a regular black tee. Um, yeah, so this is <laughs> my outfit, my OOTD of the day.
Hey y'all, so it's about 12.15, which is around the time that I would be having my first meal. Um, I'm working on my third bottle of water. I don't feel any hunger pains or anything. Um, so far, I'm, I'm feeling fine. So that's good. I'm just gonna continue with my water. Um, right now I have some errands to run, so I'm gonna finish this water and go ahead and run my errands really quick. And yeah, we'll just see how things go from there. If I do like feel like it's unbearable where the hunger pains are just too intense and or I feel myself getting a headache because you know sometimes when I fast I do get a headache um, after so long and the headaches are intense guys like seriously um, if it gets to that point then I'm just going to drink some um, chicken broth warm some chicken broth up in the microwave and I'll just sip on that throughout the day but for right now I am fine <laughs> Um, as you guys seen, I've been, you know, moving around, trying to keep myself busy since I woke up. So I'm fine right now. So we'll see as the day progress. I'm going to finish this water and I'll see you guys in a minute. So, I have my mini me in the car now. Hi. Since stores are back open, we're gonna go ahead and go to a few stores and and, buy, buy that, some and see if we can find a Father's Day gift. So that is why Nova's with me because who knows Daddy better than Nova? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Brother was not interested in coming with us, so he's home playing the game. Dad's working, so we're about to head to the store. Hopefully, if we find something, Nova can keep it a secret because Nova can't keep no secrets from her dad. I can't hold hot water. Yeah, you heard her. She can't hold hot water. <laughs> so hopefully we can find a Father's Day gift, guys, because Father's Day is literally around the corner and I haven't purchased anything. Like, I don't even know what we're gonna do for Father's Day. Um, but yeah. So come along to the first store we go to.
forgot to bring a bottle of water with me. So I haven't had water since I drank that third bottle of water, I think. So three or four. I haven't had any water, so I'm gonna have to probably hurry up and get home and get some water. Um because I'm starting to feel a little irritable, um, a little fatigued. I forgot to take my multivitamin also before I left the house, so I'm gonna have to go home and take my multivitamin too. Um, but I can slowly but surely feel like I'm getting agitated. <laughs> so I definitely need to hurry up and get home. We did find some things at Old Navy. I found a nice amount of stuff for um, Nova for sure. Like they had leggings that were like $2.69. So I'm excited about that buying because like I'm super cheap. <laughs> Always looking for bargains. So, um, and then I did find something for my husband. Um, so yeah, we're probably gonna head home just because I'm starting to feel a tad bit weak. So I know that I probably need to get home, drink some water, and probably sit down for a little bit. So yeah, that's what's going on right now. I wanted to show you guys the cute little sweater I got. I found at Old Navy. Isn't that cute? Look at the... Anything tie-dye, guys, I swear I love it. Um, but what really tripped me out, going shopping now and buying a size small, that's just like crazy to me because like in the past, well, my biggest was 174. So at 174, I was buying an extra large. So to be buying a small inside the store, it's just like, it still blows my mind. But this is the only thing I found for myself at Old Navy. Super cute. I know I was getting too hot for it, but I just could not resist. And it was 20% off. Um, I did find a lot of stuff for Nova though. So yeah, that's that. In case anyone was wondering where my oldest child have been, he plays video games all day. So here he is with my brother. Hey y'all, so it's um, almost 5.30 I think. Um, and I'm slowly, you know, approaching 24 hours fasting. I think my last meal was yesterday about 7.15, 7.20. Um, so I'm probably just gonna try to take a nap right now. I heard my husband just come in the door, so he'll probably take over with Nova and I'm gonna try to nap now. Hopefully I'm able to fall asleep fast. I did cut on one of my favorite shows, um, so hopefully I can fall asleep while watching this. We'll see.
I'll see you guys a little bit later. Yeah, I literally just woke up. It is like 10.35 p.m. My nap went extremely long. Nobody bothered to wake me up. So the whole house is literally in bed right now and I'm just now getting up. I can't even believe that I slept that long. Surprisingly, my stomach is not hurting or anything. I'm not feeling any hunger pains. We officially made it through a full day of fasting. As you can see, I inserted a picture of my fasting app. So I'm like at 26 hours right now and I'm feeling fine. That nap is definitely what I needed. Um, th the day is over. So I'm basically about to get in the shower and probably try to force myself to go back to sleep because yeah there's nothing else to do i overslept completely overslept um yeah so i'll see you guys probably in the morning um in the morning i'm gonna weigh myself before i drink any water and i'm just gonna go from there i'm gonna try to go all the way until 8 p.m tomorrow which will be um, a little over 48 hours fasting so we'll see how that goes I'll see you guys in the morning bye everyone is having a good morning so far today is day two of fasting for me um, at 7 56 p.m. tonight it'll be officially 48 hours so one thing I'm doing differently this morning that I didn't do yesterday is I'm gonna have a cup of coffee this morning um, I don't do coffee every day because God honest truth guys coffee keeps me up all night like drinking this one cup of coffee right now at 9 11 in the morning is gonna have me up no joke until like 2 30 a.m 3 a.m i'm gonna have to force myself to go to sleep tonight drinking this coffee um but on the flip side coffee gives me so much energy throughout the day um, as it probably does with so many people um, and I want to keep my energy up you know since I'm trying to avoid um, food I haven't decided if I'm gonna go all the way until 7 56 p.m. tonight because honestly yeah I just I can't stop thinking about food even though my stomach is not growling I'm not having any hunger pains or anything I mean, well, my stomach was making noise, you know, um, last night, but it wasn't like a painful cry. <laughs> I don't know what you'd call it, but um, it, it wasn't painful, you know? It, my stomach's just been making noises. So, I'm gonna try to go as long as possible, as long as possible. If I do break my fast before the 48 hours, it's probably gonna be um, at the, well, probably around 12.56, which will probably be one day and 16 hours fasting total. So we'll see, we'll see how it goes. But right now I'm about to make my coffee um, so I can get my day started. I'm gonna try to um, froth up some milk. 
this morning guys i've had my little frother here for like a while now and i've only used it maybe once um i'm very inexperienced when it comes to the frother so we'll see how this turns out no expert So I usually only do one tablespoon of heavy whipping cream in my coffee. I'm going to put like three in this cup just so the milk can froth better. Um, but I'm not going to pour all of this on top of my coffee. Because I don't like doing that much. Um, and not only that, this heavy whipping cream per tablespoon is one carb. So... I'm definitely not gonna do all three tablespoons of heavy whipping cream. All right, so I'm just gonna warm this up in the microwave for about 10 to 15 seconds because I'm having hot coffee. I wanna have um, some warm, frothy milk on top. So that's what I'm gonna do. Then you guys will see the end product. good afternoon so it's about 1 35 p.m and i wanted to give a quick update i'm still going strong haven't ate anything um, i'm on i think i'm on my like fourth bottle of water um so just a couple things that i've noticed like when i leaned over to grab some clothes out of the dryer when i went to lift back up um i did get lightheaded a little dizzy um and then i just notice every time i sit down for a period of time and stand up i'm a little dizzy small growling from my stomach but i'm not starving yet to where i have to have to have something um and yeah so i mean you know so far i'm still going strong i don't know how i'm able to keep my composure you know, throughout the day um, with the meals that I have to cook for the kids. Like this morning, I made them some sprinkle pancakes. And um, this afternoon, I made them some Oreo cookie shakes. It's hard because <laughs> it all smells so good. But, you know, you got to be strong and push through it. Um, I kind of had to plug my nose so I don't smell the goodness. Um, so that's definitely hard when you still got to cook throughout the day for your family and you're fasting. Yeah, that, I think that's the, the hardest part of it all. Um, but yeah, so still chugging along. I'll probably check back in in another couple hours um, to give another update. Talk to you guys later. Hey y'all, so um, 
it's almost 3 p.m. Um, and I just realized that what I want to break my fast with, um, I don't have them in my pantry. So if you guys are not familiar with refeeding, refeeding is extremely, extremely important. Um, once you are winding down to breaking a long-term fast, and when I say, say long-term, um, anything over 36 hours is considered long-term. When you're about to break your fast, it's very important that um, you don't break it with something heavy. Um, and it is recommended that you slowly start refeeding um, up to six hours before you actually break your fast. So I'm going to go to probably a gas station because that's the closest to grab some nuts. Um, and I already have some chicken broth in the house. So I'm gonna slowly start eating nuts and sipping on some chicken broth up until 7.56 p.m., which is when I hit the 48 hour mark. Um, and the nuts and the chicken broth is to reintroduce food to my body. I don't wanna put my body in shock. Um, I don't want to get myself sick by having like a big meal. Um, so I'm not sure if I'm just going to do the nuts and the chicken broth today, like slowly throughout the day, you know, nibble and sip on that. Um, and then tomorrow, um, reintroduce a solid food like a, a chicken salad like i have one of my chicken caesar salads the pre-packaged one in the refrigerator right now um i might just do that tomorrow um or i'll nibble on the nuts and sip the chicken broth all the way up until 7 56 and then have that chicken caesar salad i haven't decided what i'm gonna do i know right now at this moment i'm still not starving small um growling in my stomach but I'm okay you know I'm not struggling right now um, I don't feel like I have to have something right now but I do want to make sure that I refeed the right way um, and I don't get sick and if I have lost any weight I don't want to immediately right away gain it right back because that that's what happens when you do long-term fast and then you know, you break your fast with something big and you just go back to eating um, the way you used to eat, like all the way it comes back. Now, it it wasn't the goal to, to lose weight during this fast. I'm more so just wanted to clean my body um, of any, you know, bad foods, any toxins that I may have in my body. That's the main thing that I wanted to do. Weight loss is just an extra bonus. Um, so yeah, just wanted to give that quick update. I'm headed to the gas station to grab some nuts, hopefully. <laughs> you know, with my luck, I'll drive to this gas station, they're all out of nuts. Um, but yeah, that's all I need to grab from the gas station. So I'm about to go do that. Um, yeah, and I'm just gonna go from there. Talk to you guys later. Listen, excuse my appearance. I know I'm looking real <laughs> crazy right now, but I'm about to break my fast. It is 8.04 p.m. I have my salad here, my egg I added to it, my chicken, Caesar dressing. I'm about to tear this up. Y'all don't even know. <laughs> I'm about to eat this like there's no tomorrow. Oh my, God. I've been waiting for this all freaking day. I'm officially at the 48 hour mark, 48 hours fasting, guys. I'm so proud of myself. I'm super excited to eat. I'm happy that this is over. <laughs> um, 
So yeah, I'm about to eat my salad, enjoy my salad. Let me go on and do my first bite on camera for y'all. Y'all just don't know how good this tastes. This store-bought salad, packaged store-bought salad tastes like heaven right now. It is so good. You made it all the way to the end of this video. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell to be alerted each time I post. Um, yeah, and comment down below, man. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next video. Peace. <laughs>